Hey guys, Gus the Guy here, back with more Early Access Fun, in the form of course of Medieval Engineers. So today we are going to continue, of course, our work on the Archery Tower, which is coming along nicely. I'm very, very happy with how much progress I've gotten so far. Of course it still has some work that needs to be done, so uh, let us not tarry and get back to work. So let me pull up my HUD here, That's, that would be a good idea. Um, so we're just gonna keep building up. The next level, I mean, it's not really anything that's gonna go in this particular space. It's kind of there. I mean, I suppose it is. One could argue it's wasted space. Um, so maybe I will do something with that. If nothing else, I could just put a fucking uh, whatever the hell a s place to stand when you're here. <laughs> um, I can't think of the word, but I'm sure there is a word, and I just don't know it because my vocabulary is apparently very lacking. Oh, well, um, well, I won't let me place it there, although it did occur to me that it would probably block the staircase, so, whatever. Totally unnecessary, I know, but it's, it's there. <laughs> I suppose I could put a fire bucket or something there for light purposes. Voila, it has a function. An unclear function, but a function nonetheless. So once you get up there, this is the next floor. If I can find the piece I want. And then let me place it, of course. It, it will. F ah, fabulous. Um, okay. You know, I'm already jumping into building, and I just realized I haven't thanked my newest subscribers just yet. Oh, let me do that. I have it pulled up right here. And my first subscriber on my list of new subscribers is Jack O'Neill. Joe Wheat. Wheat. Edward Mulcahy. Mul Mulcahy. Morgan Schmidlin and Zoron Zoran. I can't say your name, Zoran. I apologize. I hope I didn't offend you by saying your name so horribly. Anyway, thank you guys all so much for being my newest subscribers. I'm currently sitting at 790 subscribers as of 12:33 a.m. on April 3rd. So there we are. We're at 790. We're close to 800. Hoping I can get to 800 in the next couple of days, and then a thousand, hopefully by the end of this month. Um, because as you are probably well aware, my subscriber growth has slowed considerably, which I kind of expected to happen, so no big deal. Um, I consider it's just me putting in my dues. Every new YouTuber has to go through with the pain of um, unpredictable subscriber growth, so. There we go, and if you hear that, that is a sound of thunder behind me, which I was hoping would hold off for the time being, at least give me long enough to uh, record things, but evidently it has no mercy, so there will be no such thing. Um, but I'm just gonna record over it, because fuck, fuck that, man, I ain't stopping for nothing. So, I need to make a wall of some kind here, and actually I'm gonna do it more like this, I think. No, I do like how it was before, actually. There we go, and it's deleting that. So, it's gonna have lots of windows because it is, after all, a watch post. In a sense. Or, well, it's an archer outpost as well as a watch post. I'm kind of bothered now by the fact that these aren't connecting properly, but I don't think it looks terrible, so it should be fine. Just kind of trying to get an idea of how things look. Okay, so the thing I'm basing it off of, I think, has like two or three levels to this. So we're just going to try two to start with and go from there. And I'm concerned that's going to look a little weird if I have too many windows. Um, but that's kind of a thing that we'll deal with if and when the time comes. So once I get to the second uh, layer of windows done, we're going to have another look down here just to see how it looks. Huh. I think, I think that's going to be the maximum height for that particular part of the tower. So, on top of this, of course, will be a roof. A roof to... I don't know. Just be there, kind of. And I would like the second floor to be accessible completely, so... Or the second level to have a point, even, um... Shockingly, or for the best, um, this thing has not yet collapsed, which is awesome. I'm very pleased about that. Uh, where are the floor pieces? They are right here. So I just need to place you here, and you here. It seems okay. Um, you'll just have to duck your head down. Oh, it didn't look like I had to duck. Looking looking good, then. That's excellent. Most definitely excellent. Here you do have to duck, however. There we go. 
But it's a military building. Comfort is not a priority in this situation. So it's looking very cool. I like how this thing is coming together. Um, it's a nice outpost for watching, for approaching enemies as well as shooting on those enemies on the lower levels. So this is a multifunction uh, archer's tower with a wooden roof, of course. So let's add that wooden roof. Let me quick save just in case the roof decides to screw something up. Well, that's critical to its structure. It's not even letting me place the roof at all. Uh, well, perhaps if I support it in a, some way. How do I want to support it, though? I didn't really... I wasn't planning on doing supports on here. I'm assuming it needs supports because of how I decided to build it. So I might be able to fudge it a little bit. Ah... Damn it. Um, you know what I can do just to make up for this lack of coordination, if that's even a sensible way to put it. I will delete these, and then I'll just have it go in, uh, if that made, made any sense at all. Like so. So, it might actually give it a nice texture to the building. If nothing else, it doesn't look bad because it's still fully symmetrical. <laughs> um, towers, I do believe in symmetry, so... I know I say nothing wrong with a little asymmetry, but in this case, symmetry is key. And then we'll do one right here, and then touching him right there, and then lastly, this guy right here. Then now I should be able to place a roof, and I saw I accidentally placed something down here. I want to make sure I didn't ruin anything. I did. <laughs> I don't have a way down anymore. Okay, we fixed it. I was worried I was going to lead everything in that instance, but I didn't. So quick save real quickly. Run back upstairs if I can. There we go. And start placing this roof. While I'm thinking about it, this just popped into my mind. Um, I'm thinking there's going to be something new coming to my channel. Not just a new game series, but something relatively new altogether. I don't want to say what it is just yet. All I will say is it, inju it involves uh, medieval engineers. And we'll leave it at that for now. But it will involve so much more than just medieval engineering. Um, but it's just a matter of me making sure I can actually do it before I make any promises of it um, but yeah something new is hopefully coming I'm not sure when it will come to pass um, but it's coming and that is all I will say right now just be on the lookout ladies and gentlemen for my newest potential series that should hopefully not only be a good series that'll help me in multiple ways it'll also also help me with interacting with you guys Something that I always love to improve my ability to do. Um, trying to fix this roof. I was deleting it because um, I wanted it to look like this. And it had a weird flat part. And you saw it. You know what I'm doing, right? Either way. Um, so I'll just have to like, try to go back and delete the pieces uh, one by one. Hopefully I'm not fucking anything up in the process. There we go, and then delete this little piece. That looks okay, um, I think. Well, what's the alternative? There really isn't an alternative. Well, deleting the entire wall seems to be a good alternative to the game. Uh, for the game, at least. And I need to fucking... Oh, my. My golly. By the gods. May not even be worth it now. Um, God, I'm lazy. Um, there we go. And there we... Uh, hopefully, we go. Please don't delete the wrong... Okay, you son of a bitch. Well, fuck you. Ah, oh, just fuck you. You know, we're just gonna leave it how it is for now. Because this is not going well at all. Oh, I need to fucking replace everything. I didn't even realize I did that. That much deleting... Five. And I need a roof tile that goes here. We're wasting too much fucking time on the roof. And I just say none of that shit is necessary right now. So we're just gonna forget about it. And we'll deal with it later. So that looks fine. Um, let me take... So yeah, this is done, I think. This is the archery tower. I I like it. I mean, it's, it's unique. Um, yeah, I think I do like it. I'm not so sure just yet. Um, what would it look like at night? Just out of curiosity. I know it's not very well lit. Um, yeah, it's, it does still look kind of comfy. Wow, what's that over there? Is that the... Oh, that's the church tower. That looks so relaxing. Ah, oh, comfy. Comfy. You guys know what I mean when I say comfy. 
That shit list looks comfy. Where's the castle at? Why isn't it lit up on the landscape? Where the hell is the castle? Did I lose it? No, it should be... Should be somewhere over here, I think. I think I see it. Uh, the outline, just barely. I sure hope I'm going to the right place. Oh, whatever. This is boring to you. Probably watching me uh, stare into the darkness. Yes, that is the castle. Just curious how come it was so dark. I mean, maybe it's a lights out protocol, so enemies can't spot them from a distance. And then become a target. I don't know. This is kind of bothering me that you can't see it from the village. Uh, so actually, I would like to do something like this and just give it some uh, authenticity. Uh, no, not authenticity. Whatever the hell you want to call it. Just some light. Fuck. I just want some a light. Fuck. No, I just want to light this this motherfucker up a little bit so you can see it at a distance. Because I love how light looks in this game. I mean, it's so dark in this world because it's all natural lighting. Um, I don't know, it just looks nice. It looks it looks cozy, honestly. This whole game is cozy to me. Oh, internet, you are just one hell of a drug. I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about right now. Well, let me have a let me have a look see here. This just, just so I can see how it looks. Oh yeah, that's well lit. That is one well lit motherfucking castle. Wow, that looks good. Let me go back to the village here. We're gonna run, or we're gonna try to run. Actually, why is the light so white now? Did they change that about this game? Before it was yellowish. That's strange. I heard something being kicked, so I was concerned. Uh, it doesn't appear anything got kicked in actuality, though. So we're trying to... I'm going to light things up, actually, as I go. So I'm going to put up wall torches as well. If it'll let me... I could have sworn I did light wall torches in here previously, but apparently I didn't. Because if I did, there would be wall torches here. And actually, it's probably best to not do it at night. So I can actually see what I'm doing when I place things. There we go. And let me crouch my ass through this hallway of death. And what we'll need here, we'll need lots of lighting sources, probably. Uh, we'll do it like this. I think that'll look okay, not excessive. I hope it doesn't look excessive, at least. Um, or weird, or anything. I just wanted to have positive adjectives describing it. That's all I ever wanted. Positivity is key, and I'm pretty sure that these were a block higher. Oh well. Okay. Detail orientation. That is not my... That is not in my skill set. Um, evidently. Clearly, it's not. We'll just leave it at that. Uh, you can go here. All one right here. And we'll put another one right fucking here. Beautiful! Now at night. They should at least be able to see something. Yep, they can. This actually looks not half bad at all. Although, the issue is... Um, they can't see shit out there. Although, any attackers probably couldn't see shit either, so it's probably not the worst thing to have happen. Let me turn on the light again so I can place some more of these torches. Get a good feel for things. So this is... No, this is the flight that I wanted to put here. This is the watch area, then. We're just gonna light up with floor torches, I think. And... I can put another one right here, I mean... I know it looks kind of funky, maybe, um, but you can deal. You can deal with it, assholes. I don't know. Sorry, I'm rude. There we go. So, there you have it. You can now see. Clearly, in the dark, hopefully. Yes, you can. That actually looks really nice. I think it needs a little bit of furniture. Don't you agree? So, let's clear off this toolbar here. I wish, uh, I wish there was, like, a clear all button. I know it's not a big deal, but it'd be a nice convenient little thing to have at my disposal. So we're gonna add little furnitures. And of course, flags. Actually, I don't want the big flag. I want the little flags. There we go. Remind you who you're doing this for. King Herba Blurb, I think, is his name that I set for him. And of course, put one right next to the fire for safety. Uh, sorry if I'm messing with the day and night too much. I'm just having fun, guys. Leave me alone. Leave me be. So initially I was thinking I was going to put like a little sleeping quarters somewhere in here. But actually, now that I think of it, it may 
You know what I could do? As much as I like these, I could repurpose this area as a sleeping area. So guards who are on watch can take shifts and just take turns sleeping. I mean, that could be what I how I do this. Let me quick save here. Of course, it did this, but I know the solution now. Ah, look at that! I'm clever. Um, I'm gonna try it. I'm just gonna try it and see how it looks. That is quick saved. That's why the screen went black before Kessler. Don't forget. I don't know what the hell I just deleted, but I right clicked and I feel like something got deleted. Hopefully, nothing got deleted then. In that case, okay, we're gonna leave that too. Hopefully, this comes together nicely. Well, whatever. Delete everything. I wanted to delete everything. I was holding alt. I don't know why you deleted every single object in that corner. But whatever. It selectively deletes things. Not based on the player's selection, mind you. It selectively deletes based on the game's selection. You son of a bitch. Let me block pick for fuck's sake. Okay, so the idea is to... Instead of those there, we're going to put these flooring pieces in here. If I can navigate this place properly, that'd be fantastic. And then we'll have a bed or something here for those clowns to take naps in. Lazy bastards. Um, but I mean, it is a long shift after all, so they probably do deserve a little nap or something. Where the hell did my... Oh, I must have block picked it away. Oh, I'm not even going to bother with block picker. You should know better by now, dude. Dude. I'm calling myself dude. Because I'm so hardcore. So you go upstairs. Just need to make sure things... Okay, this was here before then. I could get more space out of this place. <coughs> Excuse me. If I move the staircase here instead. In fact, that is exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, so some more extreme modification. Um, bear with me because there is bound to be some frustration inbound to my position. Um... Please don't delete everything. Oh, you bastard. I hate you. Oh, I fucking hate you so much. I hate you. Oh, th oh, I thought I deleted you, you bitch. Okay, I don't know what I deleted, but I clicked like five times in that one spot before it deleted what I wanted. Uh, I'll just have to go back and correct it. Going back and remodeling things, so to speak, is a terrible idea in this game, so just don't do it. Get it right the first time is my best advice I can give you. Wow. Okay. Okay, so I just need to fucking do this. Um, then I need to do the same thing here. Hopefully the roofs will correct themselves when I place a block next to it. I hope. If it doesn't, then fuck everything, man. Fuck everything. Let's fuck it all. Fuck them, man. Profanity. Wow, I'm already at 20 minutes. I didn't think I was playing that long at all. Yikes. I mean, I guess that's good, because I'm having fun. I didn't think I've been spending 20 minutes on this uh, terrible creation. Well, this awesome creation. I don't think it's terrible at all. Yes. Yes. Ah, look at me. I'm not wasting space at all. So, a bed can fit right here. Comfortably, of course. Comfort is secondary in this situation, I would say. I don't know how big the garrison is here, but it's actually going to probably end up being relatively large. I mean... Yeah, is that good? You know what, instead of putting that there, how would a, like a little table or something look right around these parts? So people could hang out and have snacks and... We'll have a chest here maybe for... That's where all the snacks are stored. All the raw, or not the raw meats, the dried meats because they eat like dried and geared meats or some shit, right? I don't know, I'm not a fucking... I don't fucking know. But that's not what I am. And you got a couple chairs here. You and your best bud can eat a couple mashed taters. Um, I don't fucking know. There you go, looking good to me. I'm actually very happy with how this, what this ended up being instead of just what it was originally. So a couple of guys could, if they get off their watch shift, they'll, oh, I gotta fix that now. Um, 
and I'm probably gonna have to do some major renovations here. Um, that's always fun. Actually, though, I think I'll do that off camera. Uh, I have bored you guys long enough with my mild humor commentary. Blah. Uh, so that's all for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and seeing the completion of my tower. Let me get down to the bottom so I can show you in more detail what it is. And this fucking torch is just gonna get on my nerves. It's gone. Bye bye. Let me run back down here. Zero. Turn up the HUD so we can get a better look. There it is. This is where all the brave men and women of King Herba or Baron Herba Blurp's army reside. And there's a great castle right in the distance, well lit as ever. And this place is just awesome. Structural integrity is in, in, indeed on, of course. Let me quick save and just make sure we're safe. Um, yeah, look at that. Nothing's collapsing. Nothing's at risk of collapsing. That's excellent. I have done a fine job, haven't I? Recreating um, something I found on Google. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Be sure to share it if you liked it. Be sure to hit that like button if you liked it. And if you really liked it, be sure to hit that subscribe button and become a part of the greatest community on YouTube. Anyway, I'm Kessler the Guy, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye! I'm to tax, so to speak, after this guy goes. down this door. Ah! Oh yeah! That, that took long enough, but I beat it. A long last. I beat this battle. Oh, glorious. Alright, now what do I do? Go up the next floor.